to sleep through this last night. So. Let's see what happens. Yeah. We shall see. But, uh. Yeah. Well, here we go. Midnight. Industry. Jesus, that house is huge. That lady really knew how to live. It's like the Chateau de Adler. There is something up with her. She has this giant house. She's burying, like, secret messages all over the place. I mean, this is crazy. Yeah, and we can leave it to Scrappy-Doo or whoever to figure it out. What's a Scrappy-Doo? Yeah, but we could figure it out. Aren't you the least bit curious? There's not going to be a sunken pirate ship at the end of this, Alex. It's just a wrecked submarine. Yeah, and if you're really so anxious, you can come back on your own time. I just want to get home. Oh. Oh, it's like a... It's like a boat that needs keys. There are no oars. And before we go crazy, it's not... It wasn't with Maggie's stuff back at the office, like with the radio? No. We looked through all of her stuff, I think. Huh. Well, uh... What's plan B if we can't find it? Um... Keys, they... They have to be in the house, for the movers or her family, you know? That's as good a guess as any. Sometimes when I lock myself out of my house, I'll just... I can't help but just stare at the deadbolt trying to, like, hypnotize it to open or something. You ever do that? Um, not really. But we can try that now if you think it'll help. something in here. Just looks like vacation slides or something. Huh. Ren, you were right. There's like a ledger here. The Adler family does own the island. And here's a combination for a padlock to a chest is all it says. 29, 18, 54. A chest? Have you seen one yet? Let's just look. It'll probably just be more whatever, banking files or something, but maybe we'll get lucky. She made a lot of, what should I call these, slides? They're, they're not videos. Um, silent memories? Silent memories? What are you gonna call them, Jonas? Silent memories. Memories. It's a radio lock. The woman sure did love her antiquated security. That is a nifty gizmo. Jesus. scared me. Thought you were like Maggie Adler's dead body or something. How would that make sense? How do you get in here? The door was locked. Do you have like a radio? No, I don't have a radio. The kitchen window was open. Kitchen window? Where? In the back. In the kitchen. Okay, sure. Look, Clarissa's is here. So everyone's here now. We can just... Everyone's okay, all right? That's a good yeah, thing. Yeah, let's just... Find the keys to the boat, or a phone, or whatever, and just find a way home. 
I promise. We can all keep talking and or fighting at school on Monday. I don't care what she says. Just everyone keep your eye on her. Yeah, I just might climb through the kitchen window again. Who knows? Okay, we get it. Ha ha, carry on. Everybody find something and hope that it helps. How are you doing? How are you doing? Look, Jonas, are we, like, okay? I mean, because of the whole taking not you to town thing. I'm not going to pretend it didn't bother me a little, but it'd be stupid to, like, tonight has been bad enough. I'm not going to crab about that. I mean, are you, like, mad at me or something? No, no, we're... I want to be okay with you. I just... If we keep at each other's throats, I don't know if I'll be able to make it through the night. Me neither. So let's just not be at each other's throats anymore. There. See? Easy. Ah, <sighs> it's been disconnected. Bummer. She owned enough books. It's mostly math, I think. Ergodic thermodynamics. And what? religion. Sheesh, okay, there's a lot of... Okay, we get it. She liked the smell of paper. Fascinating insight. We'll all miss her dearly. Okay, why don't you get off your ass and help then? I am helping, by keeping out of the way of more enterprising sorts like yourself. Ugh. Ugh. Put some clothes on. <laughs> Remember that guy? Where are your parents? You kids better than- Oh, um, Chad's lake house. Yeah, yeah, that guy was a friggin' weirdo. Uh, yeah. Hey, Nona. Hey. Okay, so this is probably a terrible time to bring this up. Actually, I know it is, but Ren really does mean well, so just take it easy on him. No, uh, please, let's talk about something normal. But, uh, yeah. I will, no problem. I'm still okay. Okay, let's see what Clarissa's up to. Clarissa? Your Highness. For the 800th time, and I don't even know why I feel like I have to keep selling you on this, but here it goes again. Michael wasn't my fault. <sighs> as long as you believe it, I guess. It's an attic. Thought it was like a cat's toy or something. <laughs> Ooh, oh, you know what? This might be the um the chest that takes that combination. Twenty nine, eighteen, fifty four. It's a lot of radios and those containers we saw at the town office. Oh, and like a map of the caverns. She's written here. Tune into the source? What do you think that means? She couldn't have known about the ghosts, right? Tune into the source. It, it's probably something about the special radios, you know? Huh. Is this... Ah, the boat keys. Got them. Perfecto. All right, we got keys for the boat. Where? Jonas found them in a chest upstairs. So, say thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. I was just saying it. It's not directed at you or anything. Okay. You did not mean to go back upstairs. Oops. Going on. You're confused, aren't you? 
Well, you should be. Mm. How does it go? Things are different, except in a different way. <laughs> Just come downstairs so we can get started. Oh no. Oh no. I don't trust her. <laughs> I do not trust her. Here comes a candle to light you to bed. Here comes the sword to chop off your head. What the fuck? Nona, come on, honey, it's time to motor. Nona, come on, Ren. Oh, come on, Ren, are you asleep? Ren. Okay, Hannah. Come on, Jonas. I, I really need you. Don't blink out on me now. Where's the sleep? Wait a minute. Ah, there you uh. are. Now we imagine you're a bit confused. But don't fret. This will be the final part of your training, Alex. All training is supervised by very skilled instructors. Stop. Just stop whatever this is, can't you? Just just fix my friends, please. Your friends are as fine as they've ever been, okay? There's nothing to bleed over. You signed up for this, Alexandra. I didn't know. In the caverns, you tuned in to our signal. So please, I cannot bear your excuses, offspring. How was I meant to know what the hell was gonna happen? And yet, without understanding your footing, you still acted. Don't worry. The test is easy. We will speak of something we see in the house, and you will go and find it. See? As simple and good humor as your mother's apple pie. What is it with you guys and all the... the games? You're like dogs or children. Just what is the point? The point, dear. The point is that they were never games. And you can figure that out by your lonesome. Now, let's start with the softball. I spy, with my little eye, radiation. There is, of course, a time limit here. So... Ten... Nine... Eight... Seven. Is it... are you talking about the TV? Very good. Well done. The older models and the X-rays. But right now, you'd be wise to think of radiation in another sense. Pay attention. What are you even talking about? I spy. With my little eye, a notch. Let's make this a little harder, okay? Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Three. Four. Three, two, one. Uh, Alexandra, what a disappointment you've turned out to be. Jonas, come on, snap out of it. Oh, your new brother. Gone to first light. Bring him back, right now. Oh, I'm sorry, dear. What's done is done, as they say. It's time for the bonus round, Alex, so stay quick. This is what you really want to find. I spy, with my little eye, a picture of a memory. Be fast now. Five little ducks went out one day. Over the hills. And the, the picture of, of, I guess it's Maggie Adler and somebody. Is this it? Yes, very nice. That's Margaret Adler and her friend Emma. Okay. You and your schoolyard chums are experiencing, well, this has sort of happened before. Maggie and Emma tried to sport with us many years ago, and, well, only one survived. But in the process, we discovered a way for us to return, so to speak. It just takes a little time, and a far-reaching tolerance for the ignorance. Wait, what? What happened to Anna? Let's leave it at the poor girl didn't know what she was playing with. It doesn't matter. Do not an eternal recurrence. The waves. It's the waves, we think. And we will use our friends to absorb into your friends so as sunlight blooms into flowers. And we will grow. And we will engulf. No! That's horrible! We can see how this might seem. Great sense, but we're past the point of caring about that sort of thing. No. We tried it too quickly with Anna, but now we know to wait and soak. We had to keep you here, on the island. And it will be a great honor, Alex, really, to carry us through this life in 
and on to the next. There has to be another way. I mean, just maybe, I mean, maybe I can do something with the radio. We never had our time. It was ripped from us. We watched the universe's conception fly to its demise over and over and over again. You don't know what it's been like, but how could you? That is no excuse for stealing our... our souls. Well, it's the only excuse you're gonna get. When our vessel dashed on the rocks, we had until dawn, and so will you. We would spend our time wisely, and we thank you for your good service. What the...? <sighs> so, I'm kinda screwed. What now? What? What do I do? Oh man. There's the tape player. He's dead. He's not... he's not here. <sighs> so we can go on. <laughs> I, I think I'm gonna be sick. Me first. Uh, it wasn't a dream or a vision or something. You and Clarissa standing in the living room just now, was it? Ugh. I wish it was a dream. Usually there's a lot more talking horses. Oh, and by the way, next time, put some actual effort into the game. Pretty please? I felt Sorry. like someone was shoving spiders down my throat. She, uh, tried, kinda. I'm sorry, all right? I, I tried my best. I mean, when things are jumping all around, it's tough to even know what she was talking about. So, I mean, Christ, if Clarissa was whisked away to the cave by nuclear submarine monsters, then, I mean, the plan has to be to retrieve her, right? I'm still going to call them ghosts, if that's okay. A Garissa is only, like, one slice of the problem. We're all infected or whatever, so we need to rip the issue off like a bandage all at once. Okay, great, yeah. But how do we do that? Well, uh, good question. Maggie? Ah, I think Maggie Adler might have had some sort of a plan or a, a scheme or something to fix what's going on. What possible plan could Maggie Adler have? First of all, she's dead. And second of all, she was like the island Mother Goose. She didn't know She any wrote in her journal or something or other about tuning into the source of the problem in the cave. And I think she was talking about the ghosts. Well, if we're going to the cave... Oh, actually, I forgot. I saw the entrance has been caved in since you guys went inside. All right. What? I know there are a whole bunch of secret communist bomb-fearing tunnels dug into this place during the 1950s. And Maggie has loads of film about military stuff in her basement, so... Maybe there's a way back into the cave through one of those, you're thinking? <sighs> Let's take a look. What's what kind of name is a Fippany Fields anyway? Wait, is it a Fippany? It's a Piffany Field. Oh, that makes more sense. Is there anything else in the house? Is Clarissa gonna come out and spook us again? Want to see if it'll start? Uh, 
Not really. Be careful, that film's really flammable. Wouldn't want Smoke and Johnny to light the house on fire. Ha ha. Oh, that's right. All right, there's already something in here. Experiments and findings of experienced phenomena, January 52. Awesome. Oh, man. If this turns out to be just prehistoric home videos... Yeah. I'm sure this is just... God, it's just the first thing. Just give it a second to warm up, will you? You can, uh, skip this one, Alex. Okay, we're getting warmer, I think. So, if you look at the, like, lines or whatever, the bomb shelter should lead right into the cave, just like from another angle. According to this, at least. Oh, so it does. But won't it be, like, locked or something, right? Yeah, how do we get in? It's just like the cave wall, only steel or whatever bomb shelters are made out of. Oh, what? She knew about these things? Wow, that's crazy. It says that to fix a temporal tear, that's a mouthful, in the cave, we would need to transpose to the other side and tune into the source within itself. Okay, but we're not doing that, right? Good question. Yeah, that's, that's going a little above, above and beyond. Well, I don't know what to tell you, but strap in, boys and girls, because we might have to, okay? If it's the only thing that will fix us. Yeah, but that's like, scary. Well, something better work. Or we're boned. Or we're boned. Precisely. Oh, sorry. This is like, this looks like the end, but from the, from the wrong film thing. No, no, no. Wait. This is something I actually remember from that stupid radio tour thing, because it, like, sounded so weird. It's called the call and response system. It unlocks the bomb shelter. This is showing us how to do it. See? It says, when someone sends an emergency signal from the Capard station in the woods, and the receiving station confirms it. It's like a connected response thing. Brilliant! Really? It's good enough for me. Alex and me will head through the woods, do the, um, call part. You and Ren can hang by the door to the bomb shelter and open it when it's ready. Wait, wait, I, um, I'm sorry. I kind of zoned out there for a second. What are we doing? Ren and Nona are team, um, Soaring Eagle, and you and I are awesome squad. Uh, I want that one. And we're splitting up to work on some old fangled machinery to open the bomb shelter, to get into the cave, to yada yada yada, save our lives, or whatever. Use the response station to open the bomb shelter. Adler number station 441. Okay, so. We gotta go back up. Alright. All right, break. And if anything goes wrong, please, don't tell me. I won't want to know. Same here. I don't want to know nothing. <laughs> I don't want to know nothing. Hey, Drew. Didn't know you were still awake, buddy. I wouldn't split a good job this way. In beach. No, 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 I'm not upset. I'm just talking quietly. just it's late night I wonder what's down here
Oh no, I'm just tired. Well, because like everybody's asleep right now, so. This is my quiet place. Don't worry. I'm fine. Oh, let's just get back to the. Okay. Oh, Maggie says she hopes the notes are found by the correct person. Well, I guess that'll have to be us. To whoever is finding these notes, understand my hope is that by shrouding this intelligence in such an obtuse manner, his detection would have discouraged most innocent seekers, thereby allowing it to befall the correct person and not the easily distracted military mind nor the typically bewildered execution. Excursionist, sorry. Do not blame the submarine crew. I don't believe its passengers like Harry Griffin can even understand wh what has truly happened to them. And you do not have to forgive me for my myriad failures, but please remember the name Anna Shea. Know that she did not deserve her fate. Why are you nervous, Drew? What's up? Talk to me. Circles are up, I can't do anything right now. Okay, let's go back. Oh, you going to TwitchCon? Ugh, I wish I was going. Wish I could go. I'll have it on the bucket list for next year, though. fun dude are you leaving like early tomorrow or I know <sighs> it'd be it would be really fun but you know money and all that jazz but I'll make it my big con next year 2019 I gotta focus on Star Wars celebration though so I'll plan on it. Plan on it for next year. Jo Jonas, are you coming? Jonas, let's go. Did you fall asleep again? Yeah, I'm gonna be at Twitch because I'm really nervous because of all the streamers I want to collab with are going and meeting together. Okay, if you could tell them to be prepared. You know, it, it happens to the best of us, honestly. Like, I get major anxiety when it comes to job interviews, but I always put on a good game face and make myself presentable and be the best person I possibly can. So, just like, acknowledge the fact that that happens to you, and you'll be fine. Just Find a way to take care of it. Uh oh. Oh no, Ren. Ren. Alex. Alex. Okay. Are you, are you back to normal? I just saw. It, it, it was like a premonition, I think. And I know that sounds whatever, but this must be what it's like when people say they do that. Cause, I kind of just saw Ren drowning. Okay, okay, just take it easy for a second. You went all red-eyed, like when we get possessed. I okay. did? You stopped walking and started mumbling, and then your eyes lit up like little road flares. It only lasted like a minute, but we should hurry up and do this before the door on you opens any wider than. But the thing with Ren, it was so real. It was like it... 
I was there with him. Maybe we should go back. But I'm sure he's fine, so let's finish what we started. Hold on, replaying to us now. I try, dude. Oh, you're close to TwitchCon? No. Oh. Nice. Okay, it's playing pub. Where do I send this? Oh. Interesting. Doesn't say I'm doing anything. But Tend to start streaming, um, like 30 minutes ago. This is my late night stream. I did this last night and I had a whole bunch of people follow me, so. I do this when, like, big streamers like Skunk Oder go to bed. And Definitely be. Oh, 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 oh. When I start f first streaming, like on Twitch? I started streaming on Twitch like almost a month ago. Almost. I think. Hold on. I can give you exact. I want to say I started streaming a month ago. Mm, let's see. When did I post Fallout New Vegas? Yeah, uh, uh, a month ago already. No, 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 no. I don't want to watch myself play Fallout New Vegas. <laughs> yeah. Gosh, that did not suck in. <laughs> yeah, September 2nd, I started streaming. So, it's been like a month. <laughs> you have been here since the beginning. So, yeah, already in a month I have 15 followers, that's so like... You know, that's kind of a big deal. A little over a month now, but you know, you gotta start somewhere. And then, I like, I figured out how to do an overlay. I put OPS on the big laptop, so hopefully I can figure that out. And get that all squared away so I can start doing streams on that, because my laptop doesn't want to acknowledge OPS. It's old. It's like five years old. And I'm needing a new laptop, so yeah. Oh, by the way, Drew, I made a Discord server for um, my Twitch. So if you want that, let me know. Hannah was still awake. Should not be there. Maybe stream three times a month for the most good fuck schedule. 
You only have 61 followers over three months? That's really good. Yeah, like, I'm impressed with how well the um, Xbox One mic sounds when I talk into it, so yeah. Yeah, here, let me give you the link. There you go. Don't be like uh, the second person in there, so I need to. I'm only opening it up when I stream. So. There you go. Oh, sorry, I read the three months. <laughs> Been streaming for a year. It's not bad. I've got, um, well, I've got Dreamer. I've, I've been talking to Dreamer, so. Getting used to starting to run skunks people and, you know. <laughs> You'll be the second person to join. I need to get Hammy in here, too. Wait, Alder Letter. I didn't know Maggie grew up in Maine. Maine's so nice. There's a smaller statue of a soldier in Maine where I grew up. My memory of it is that I think part of the reason why I said yes when the army recruited me out of college. Oh, why I said yes when the army recruited me out of college. Despite my family's protestations. Anna, my close friend from childhood, was, one, was of course thrilled at the possibility of my escape. I anonymously started the petition in 1975 to have this one made after the daughter of Kanoa, crewman Francis Salter, asked. I don't know why, a marker maybe for the, for the hope I once had to help people. <laughs> Whatever you choose to call your following, I have no clues what I would call my following. Do I mean, Drew Fort. I'm just using Rogue Clan because, you know, it's there. But yeah. Okay, so. Um. Oh no, that's not what I want. I want the letters. Okay. I got the last letter a little too soon. Oh, you know what I should call it, Drew? I know what I should call it. I know what I should call it. I know I'm, I'm gonna change the name in a minute. Enforcers. No, it's not. The Drew Forces. <laughs> I want to call it Rogue Squadron. Like the game. I'm such a nerd. I should call it the. Oh, there's the letter. That woman, Marianne Bozik, helped her transcribe the ghost's transmissions. Ooh. That's a rare achievement. Nice. Cool. I got a rare achievement that's really neat. Oh, girl. Why? Oh, Hammy's not responding. Yeah, I think I'm gonna change the name. Hey, Anna. You're here, okay. Well, I'm gonna edit. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, not my nickname. Mm -hmm. There we go. There we go. Oh, 
Love you too, Hannah. Alright, Drew. Well, I updated the Discord, so. <laughs> okay, let me read the letter. Oh, I'm just tangled. I am tangled. Alright, let's see what this letter says. Marianne Bosk. Bozik, sorry. Forever engraved on command. Annex's memorial plaque was a kind, humble woman who helped me decode the ghost unusual messages. I don't think she ever really, I don't think she ever really believed my hypothesis that they were relays from the sunken submarine, even though she corresponded with, as she put it, a man named Calvin, an electrician who died on Kanaloa. I pieced together the truth, the cover-up, and my own tragic mistake that killed him and his mage over months of careful deciphering. Yeah, my Discord just went blah, 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 blah. Welcome to the Sarudro. Give me those feels bad, man, Hannah. Oh, the link decided not to work? Really? I'm sorry. That's weird. Yeah, sorry about that. By the way, Hannah, I have a Discord uh, group if you want to join that, too. So. Let's see if I can get Ed to join. That's not much. Oops. Um. Excuse me. What was that? Other number station. Look right there. Hmm. I guess not. I thought there was something. Thank you for the host, Drew. Hopefully some of your peeps will watch. Basically, it's um, it's an indie game. Um, it's sort of spooky. There's like uh, Edward's Island, and you have to figure out what's happening on the island uh, with radios and radio signals. So basically, there was this uh, submarine that um, got destroyed off of the coast, and these ghosts basically live on this island, and they're overtaking these kids. So, we have to... Yeah, it's an indie game. Oxen free. The Fight Now Link is there, so... It's a pretty neat game. Um, Jack's up the guy played it, so... I thought, you know, it was free on Xbox, so I was like, hey, why not play it? It was a really great game. What's an indie? Sorry. 
not talking loud enough. My bad. Oh. Boop. Indie game means like it's not related to like EA or um, a major developer. It's made on its own. So like there was an individual team that made this. It wasn't like produced by, like, by Bethesda or EA or something like that. So yeah, that's what this is. direction. I am an idiot. I am a dum dum. Oh really? It's a little loud. Let me see if I can fix that. Maybe I can't. I don't know. Um, well, my mic volume's at 100%, so there's something more I can do. Also, I have to kind of have to talk over it, so. Because everybody's asleep in the house. Okay, where am I going? I'm going to... I'm going right, okay. Epiphany Fields. Epiph. Hmm. I live at home right now, so yeah. Oh, Hannah, she she popped up while you were talking. She's in the chat. I think still. Hannah. Hannah, if you're not asleep, say hi to Drew. I knew she had to go like take care of her havoc. It's not imaginary. <laughs> Hannah's in here. Oh, believe me, this game gets creepier. You've met some important plants. This is like towards the end of the game already. I played a lot of it last night. Do a follow.
It is something. Jig three. The island is famously named after Colonel Caleb Edwards for his glorious and triumphant slaughtering of countless families during one of the great ethnic cleansings of the 20th century. The fourth. Hold on. All right. Yeah, I might have fallen asleep, but you'll probably meet her whenever I stream again. A lot of people are going to TwitchCon, so I'll probably be streaming while everybody's doing that. Do I need to go to the comm tower? Use this first box as well. Oh no, I gotta go one more up. Okay. Why is that being held? <laughs> Why did Automod pick up AF as a swear? It's weird. Weird. Hey, if like you have your phone or something you could watch, but you know. You do you. You know what time it is? It's four in the morning, which is usually about the time everyone decides if they're going to bed or ordering another three pizzas. Yeah? What's your vote usually in uh, that situation? Uh, pizza. Never leave pizza on the table. It's like getting 11 in blackjack. Just double down. Don't even think about it. You think this <laughs> tuning into the tear thing's gonna work? Like, really? It really doesn't matter if I think it's gonna work. It's sort of all we have, and we're running out of time. It is all we have, yeah. I just... I just wish I felt like the ghosts were concerned that their plan won't work. I just feel like they're pretty confident. Like they know by sunrise they're all gonna be shopping for school supplies. Yeah, well, you know who else was confident? Hitler. And look how he ended up. Dead. With syphilis. Oh, true. I had to make that reference, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, jeez. Well, Drew, I hope you have a good night. Sleep well, friend. I think this, um, stuff is getting pulled in from, like, their time or something. This is so weird. Um, yeah, it's not exactly a good omen. I think we're running out of runway here. Is this rock doing anything? There's a rock, there's a rock, everywhere's a rock, rock. Oh, Brawly just my life, oh boy. Hi Drew, sleep well, buddy. I wonder if everybody's just watching Puppy. Now the station's up at the top of the hill. <sighs> I hope this works. Thank 
still. Weird. Really weird. Now the station's up at the top of the hill. I hope this works. <sighs> Ugh, not this again. We're in another time maze thing. Ugh, okay. We were due. It's been like a minute since the last... Now the station's up at the top of the hill. I hope this works. Yep, I am also... hope that. Uh oh. Ren! Nona, what happened? What's wrong with Ren? Ren, he's... He had an accident. He... he died. I couldn't... No, no, come on. Clarissa was dead too, but like bunny ears dead, not dead dead. Because apparently killing yourself doesn't actually do anything here. Alex! I'm sorry. I, I'm sorry, Nona. I didn't mean anything. What happened? He... he drowned. He took a fall. I don't know. He just... he just stopped. I mean, does it really matter what happened? Either way, done is done. Fix Ren, whatever you want to call it. I know you're doing it. Just fix it. It's not us doing it, dear. We weren't lying. The time loops, as you've taken to calling them, which we do find so adorable, are of your own making. Yeah, sure. Just like you infesting us like lice isn't your fault either. That we have and will own up to, but the other stuff, that we're afraid is on you. Alex, we know you're in charge and we know your plan, and we also know that your plan won't work. It never does. So we have a proposition for you. A deal. A bargain, really. Um, a proposition? L like what? It's already over for Clarissa. She's gone. We'll pilot her through the rest of existence, and there's nothing you can do to change that. But, if you agree to let us take her, let her go, quietly, without fuss, we won't slaughter the rest of your friends, like young Reginald here. We leave the rest of you cattle alone. No, no, no way! I'm saving everyone! Everyone is coming home with me. We're all getting out of here. <sighs> Courage is not always the way, dear. You don't have much time left. Do you know how we know you don't have much time left? We're getting out of here. All of us. Run too. <laughs> okay. We know because we can be Jonas for this long, and his soul is as quiet as an empty church. Just never say we did intend to provide you all the rules. Jeez. Nona? I know he was your best friend, Alex. I I'm sorry. I don't I don't know what happened. One minute he was there and then he was just gone. It's okay, Nona. You you didn't do anything wrong. I know it's not your fault. Of course it's not your fault. I didn't know him that well, but I like what I'd gotten to know. I'm sorry. It's I shouldn't. It's colossally stupid of me to talk about him like that with you here. This is... He was more important. No, not really. Ren would be flattered to hear you say anything about him, so... If he can hear this at all, trust me, he's over the moon right now. Sure. It's a tiny thing, but... I hope he knew that I liked him. And I don't know if he did. He hopes you did. I think that's enough. Like I said, it's a tiny thing. The 
The station's up at the top of the... Ugh. God, that was... My mouth feels like I just ate a tree. The ghosts, they tried to make, like, a deal with me for Clarissa's life. I didn't take it, of course, but... I don't know, I, I just thought you should know. God, that must mean they're getting desperate or something. If they had any, like, power over the situation, they wouldn't try to work out a compromise. Anyway. Hello? Anyone there? Ren! What? Are they... Oh, they're, um, they're somehow... I guess they're somehow broadcasting or something from the, uh, station speakers. <laughs> Are you guys at the station? They're both alive! <gasps> anyway. That's all I care about. Jonas? God. Yeah, no, Jonas? that's, a, that's Jonas, you can hear this. Seriously, right in the throat. Jonas, don't listen. We're all set here for the, uh, the thing? The machinery speaking hunk or whatever we're doing? Yeah, let's do it. Speak Time's a waste. Like, actually wasted. Like, I feel my body wasting away. No, it's, it's okay if you're, like, dealing with stuff. Dax. We Dax. had to deal with stuff. Well, how? What stuff? The, uh, when I almost kind of slipped and fell off the bridge. Oh my god, you guys, that was... No, it was the... It was psychotic to watch. Like, right. almost I doesn't quite describe the terror that held my heart that. watching her come close to... Okay, it I wasn't that. Did. You were perilously close to tumbling into the ocean from like 5,000 feet up. It wasn't that high. It was like... Mm. It was high, believe me. No, it wasn't. Yeah, it was. There no, it ugh, just whatever. I'm fine. She hello, we're here. We made it. Hello. Oh, hello. This is Edward Island's emergency. How may I help you? If you're being sat on by a very large burglar, just mash the dial with your fist, please. Um, look, the the ghosts told me they wanted to to make a sort of deal for Clarissa. What? I said no, of course, but uh, I don't know. I just I thought you guys should know before moving on. All right, well, let's do the, the thing and get into the shelter and try and fix this fast. Signal verified. Shelter TF1 open. Nice. I guess it worked. Hey, we're awesome. Awesome enough, at least. Right. See you at the shelter. Over and now. This is the time hold and save the day. Awesome. Oh, hey, how many have I found already? Six. Cool. Mr. Jordan, couldn't we have him reborn? Jonas! Okay, 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 I'm... Jesus Christ, I really hate that. But I'm... I think, um... It's 
It's getting worse, Jonas. The sun's coming up soon. I think we're running out of time. Yeah. Um, look, it's scary, needless to say, when I, like, drown or whatever in my own body, and it's starting to feel like, just, like, how do I say this? Because okay, I don't... Okay, I have a time limit for rambling nonsense, so let's pick it up a bit. I just want to say, I just, I think it would have been cool, us living together for, for whatever, senior year. And I'm just glad I met you, that's all. I'm just okay. glad we met. Oh, Jonas, you big sap. Okay, all right, that's all, nothing to see here. And now we can go back to the whole escaping and trying to live another day thing. And we're gonna be fine, by the way. There's no, you don't have to put it like, it would have been whatever to live together. We are gonna live together, and you're someday soon gonna eat all the peanut butter, and when I go make a sandwich, I'm gonna be mad. <laughs> all right. <laughs> <sighs> oh, I'm stuck on my cord again. Okay. Oh god, why do this is itchy? Why must you do this to me? <sighs> Jeez, the way you do this itchy Annie on. Right now. Let's see if there's something down here. Or is it just the log? Oh no. I guess Maggie was the one who had this place turned into a park. After the fort closed, I used the considerable resources from my father's endowment to buy up most of the land or influence government officials. Or influence government officials to declare that which I could not buy protected. I have not been entirely successful and have watched in horror as a small tourist industry has precariously sprung up on this cursed island. Even the family of one of the sailors who died, Calvin Gilbert, set up a restaurant to cater the inquisitive out-of-towners. I promise this, though. The museum will never happen, and the beach and caves will be boarded up. That will never happen. When he was stationed at Fort Milner, Colonel Tim Russell would frequently wander the woods west of his barracks and sketch the wildlife he'd encounter on his walks. After the fort closed in 1974, he led a petition to make the land federally protected. And in 1988, he succeeded. Interesting. Oh, that one. Oh, we could have gone to Bridge Town that way. Okay. Oh well. Okay. <sighs> I'm gonna be 
that's it. Just in yeah, this stream here. Alright, guys. These ones are still watching. I hope you enjoyed a little bit. I get to play the night. Um, hopefully. Why are you imagining? Oh, because Drew, Drew can tell that you were. There. I was trying to tell you to talk to him, but he didn't think you were real, so. I don't know, Hannah, do you want me to keep streaming for you? Keep streaming. Oh, sorry. Do you want me to keep streaming? Can you hear me now? Sorry, I'm so quiet. Oh gosh. I keep yawning. Trying to figure out who's still awake, to be honest. Miki, where's Miki? when you tried it didn't work. Okay. Um. I'll play for a couple more minutes and then I'll call it quits. I think 1.30 I'll call it quits. I don't want to finish this game without other people watching, you know? Yeah. Okay. Uh, pick me if you want to go. Keep yawning. What is this? I tried to see if Hammy was around, but I haven't seen him, so he only sent me like one Snapchat and then he was gone. Okay, I'm gonna I'm just gonna say one thing, and then I promise it'd be the last time I bring it up tonight. But you know you screwed up with Ashley at the concert, right? I mean, it's not a giant thing, but still. What? Who's Ash? Oh. oh, you mean Amanda? My really good friend Amanda who's moving away forever? That Amanda? Yeah, that Amanda who stole her mom's car. And I don't care if you didn't know she didn't have permission to take it, because whatever, fine. But you knew you didn't have permission to go to that show. <sighs> Just tell me it's the last time I hear about you stealing a car. However inadvertently, my little heart can't handle the excitement. Nope, not promising that. What's the point in living if not to boost cars for an underworld criminal empire? I guess I can't answer that. <laughs> oh, and I wanted to say, um, <laughs> per your advice, I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna really, um, like, commit to Clarissa. <laughs> that sounds dumb, like I'm pinning her or something. Uh, maybe 
think about that for, like, a little bit. Oh my god, you sound like my guy friends. Play the field! I like her, Alex. I like her a lot. I don't want her to get away, so get used to her. Come on, let's get to the sentry before the last boat comes. I gotta get the uh, visual aid for the history project. And then I just gotta write the stupid essay. What history project? They still make you do, like, work with so little left in the year? Unfortunately. This is, it's just like a town history thing for civics, you know? So it's forced me to kind of, I don't know. And I mean, it's funny, I don't know if I even want to be here next year. It's just all so flat. Same people, the same expressions. Really? Why leave? I mean, yeah, it can suck sometimes, but it's pretty much like everywhere else. This is going to sound weird, but everybody knows me here. I know you think I have it on easy street, but people looking at you all the time, wanting evidence that it's good, that they lived here, that good things can happen to people that are from here, it can get to be a real drag. Like, how about somebody else be captain of whatever for once? You were... are great, though, and... and you're gonna be great whatever you do. I'm sure of it. You got spunk, kid. Yeah, well... <laughs> uh, let's head back before Karen Strands is here. You know, when we saw Uncle Pete last month, I wanted to ask him, because he, he got out moving to New York. And I asked him if it was hard leaving. Know what he said? Oh, no God, idea. Michael, I have no idea. I mean, knowing Uncle Peter, he was probably three sheets to the wind. He said the hardest part was deciding what to take with him and what to leave behind. I thought it was, I don't know, for him, <laughs> kind of almost touching. Oh my, how profound. I can't believe Uncle Pete's a mere failed actor and not teaching philosophy at Berkeley. Oh, shut up. <laughs> <laughs> I cannot believe I had to pick you up from the police station because of Grand Theft Auto. I mean, that is too funny. <laughs> <sighs> yeah, yeah, whatever, man. Why are you worried about Hammy, Hannah? Because he's like, he hasn't been on as much, or? Yeah, I know. He, he might be sleeping. Alex? Stop it. Just stop. Ugh. <sighs> You got, you know, you went bad again. I couldn't get you out of it. We should really, we should get this done now. I saw, I saw Michael again. I just, I'm sorry. When I'm there, I just get sucked into it like nothing happened. Come on, it's all right. I think I can hear Ren and Nona down there. Uh, but I don't want to go to Ren and Nona. That's like in game. Will allow me to go to Miller's outpost? I'm curious. Yeah, he might be sleeping. We just don't know. Oh, it's not letting me go anywhere else. Oh no! Just don't say anything to them, okay? This is... It's just like a trial period. Hey, like, secret secrets are no fun unless you share with everyone. What is it? Reveal yourselves. We're dating. We're dating. Nona and I, we're gonna date. Rin, dude, what did I just say? What? They asked, right? You asked? Ugh. Mazel tov on the happy couple. <laughs> Thank you. 
No, stop. It's one date at the Revival Theater. We're just gonna sit quietly in the dark and watch a documentary on Bosnian genocide. Hmm, romantic. Hey, one man's depressant is another chick's upper. Aw, how cute. Riviera is a great movie house. And the ushers can't tell where you're putting your hands if you sit in row G, by the way. Please don't tell him that. Anyways, <laughs> I know it's stupid to be planning or whatever for this, but I don't know. I just feel like maybe it's not that insignificant or whatever. Whatever. Truly the language of love. <laughs> Shut up. You know what I mean. Good. I'm glad. This is... I mean, at the very least, I'll get to hear embarrassing stories, so... I... I want to get this off my chest. Just... Something happened to us tonight, Alex. Something broke. I don't know if it was the ghosts or whatever, but you've been acting like not you. Ren. No, I just, I don't know. Well, I'm sorry. I don't, I don't know what else to say, really. I'm sorry. I don't know why I'm even saying this now. This is stupid, but can we, like, take a picture? Why? I don't know. In case things go bad and... Yeah, let's do it. We're on a beach. Kind of. Let's keep a shred of normal here. Picture time. All right, let's take it. Alex, get in here. You're not getting out of it. <sighs> All right. Once we're in there, the door won't open again since the system's so convoluted. So make sure you're ready to finish this before we go inside. Oh. Okay, so I guess this is a good place as I need to stop. Because I want to do more stuff before. I want to hug Ren. Hold on, before I stop, I want to hug Ren. We'll be back. Oh, I know. My fave. Ren is my fave. Oof, okay. I. Uh, Alright. Hugs. I am coming with you, you know. Yeah, yeah. I just, I just want to hug everybody, you know. Hugs all around. Okay, let's do that photo. Oh, look at them. Ren looks so happy. Look at this sweet baby boy. Oh, I didn't see that picture before. That was on the boat, on the beach. That moment you realize you can cosplay as one of the characters. <laughs> Back. Okay. Well. I'm going to end the stream here because there's like more I want to do and I want to do end game come um, later this week when everybody's a little more awake. So I think I'll stop it here, but thank you for watching Hannah. Um, yeah. Sleep well. I'll be on either tomorrow or Friday afternoon. So, yeah. Hopefully, I might get a game of cards against humanity going or something. But, yeah. Anyway. Who's on? I'm playing Warframe. Alright. Gonna stop this here. You too, Hannah. Sleep well.